All right, y'all, James Reed, back with another video on the BRS-7 gasoline stove. It is a Titan. I think they do call it the Titan. I'm going to show you how I light it. I've already got it pumped up. There's plenty of pressure. I'll pump it a couple of more times. I use isopropyl alcohol, there's a little spirit cup down on the bottom, I give it a good douse, put that away, I use a safety lighter, barbecue lighter, utility lighter, light that up, there's a wick down on the bottom that will wick that alcohol up. Alternatively, you could open the valve and let some fuel out and close the valve and then wick that fuel. The goal here is to heat the generator so that it will aerosolize the fuel as it goes through the generator tube. It's a good stove. I've made a, maybe seven stir fries on it since I've had it. Put some videos out soon of making stir fries on the walk. We're just letting that generator heat up. Burning isopropyl alcohol down in the spirit cup. The stove is pressurized. When I feel like that generator is hot, or when we start getting low on alcohol. We're going to open up the valve and let the fuel, the pressurized fuel from the tank. Ooh, it's a windy day here in South Louisiana. 20 mile an hour gust. We're going to go ahead and open that valve. A little bit, not all the way. I'll wait till that gust blows away. All right, that, I'm starting to feel like that generator's, that generator tube is hot. I'm gonna open the valve some. Open a little more, I can see a little flame at the, at the jet. Now it's open and spitting fuel. We'll open it up a little more. Bang, it's on. It's a loud stove, as you can hear. It's barely even open. I'll open it some more for you. And to extinguish the stove, just turn the valve off. And that is how you light the BRS-7 stove. There's one way to do it. I'll make a video showing you another way to do it. Peace out. Check the BRS-7 stove playlist in the description. James J. Reed.